What's up everybody and welcome to my unboxing for this month's Loot Crate of uh, November 2014. This month's theme is Battle and on the front it has a little message. It says, Attention Looters, this crate is designed differently than any other crate before it. Please read the first page of the magazine to see how. So let's open this up. November's Loot Crate Battle. Alright, so let's take a look at the box design pretty cool all right so uh all right so uh i don't know what i'm getting this month i know they hinted at some cool video game stuff like mega man as you see here street fighter and some other cool stuff from video games so um i want to start with this cool mega man the mega man box <laughs> uh mini helmet replica Ooh. And you can get any of the four colors. You can get Mega Man Blue, Mega Buster, Mega Man Gray, Bubble Lead, or Bubble Lead, sorry. And Mega Man Green Leaf Shield, Mega Man Red Rush. Awesome. So you can get blue, gray, green, red. Green is my favorite color, so I hope I get green. But if I get blue, that'll be awesome too. So, all right, let's see what Mega Man helmet replica I got. Uh, uh, if I could unbox this carefully without tearing the box apart. There we go. No damage done to the box. Awesome. Hey, I got red. And, oh, cool. Comes with a base and a, uh, what do you call those things? Uh, I forgot what you call those things. Uh display stands I guess and voila there it is Mega Man's Red Rush helmet on the display stand there looks pretty awesome and you could display this however you like or possibly put his helmet on an action figure which is what I wanted to do but I couldn't find any action figure with a head big enough for this helmet <laughs> all right so next up we have a t-shirt for this month's loot crate and it's a combination of a ninja and a pirate and maybe something else. I can't make out most of these words here. It says, right there, it says ninja, quiet, die. Shinobi, blade, myth, legend, fact. Fighter, surly, rogue, outlaw. And plenty of other words that's mixed in there, but it's pretty awesome. And I'm not sure if that red headband is a reference to Ryu in Street Fighter or Ryu, sorry. <laughs> Ryu, Ryu, you know what I'm trying to say. So that's an awesome shirt. I actually like this shirt. All right, what should I go for next? There's that thingy, there's that pin, of course, the pin, this month's Loot Crate's pin, which is awesome. It's got Mega Man and Ryu on there. November 2014, Battle. So that's pretty awesome. And of course, nothing on the back. Awesome. I actually like this month's Loot Crate pin. I see Capcom. Loot Crate exclusive. Is this a Ryu headband? <laughs> uh, I think it is. I got a Ryu headband from Street Fighter. It says, uh, yeah, Street Fighter, Capcom under it. That's pretty cool. Pretty sure I will not be wearing this unless I decide to have some fun in my videos and then I'll probably wear it for a couple of my videos when I do skits and stuff so anyways cool got that all right next up th this thing metallic series figure um, new superposable hero action figures really wait 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 so these are like kind of oh mega blocks I was wondering okay because I saw that thing I was like is this from Legos or something at first I thought it was like candy because when you shake it up it sounds like candy but it's not candy all right so it's not candy so kids this is not candy do not put this in your mouth whatever this is <laughs> all right so I tore up that plastic piece that was on the side and let's crack this baby open see what's inside this halo uh, mini figurine containment chamber whatever this thing is and I'm not sure if I'm opening it up the right way let's see here Oh, there we go. Okay. So, I'll just set that off to the side right there. And what's what's in here? Got a Mega Block. It says Halo on it. 
pretty cool. So I'll just set that down there. Um, oh, awesome. Is that who I think it is? Is that Master Chief? It looks like Master Chief, but I don't know. It's got like a different paint design around his uh, helmet there, so I'm not sure if this is Master Chief or a different character. Huh. And we got this little thing. Wait, is that his weapons? Alright. He comes with a little gun, and um, not sure what this is. Okay, so looking at the instructions, it says I could take this little guy apart somehow. And that little part that I just took out, uh, it looks like I could plug it in his back. Alright, so let's do that now. But first, let's see what's on the other side of this manual. And cool, some more metallic series um, Halo figures. Alright. Alright, so there he is. This character, uh, whatever his name is, possibly Master Chief, I don't know. Um, Alright, so let's put this thing on his back, because that's what the instruction said. It says this plugs right into the back, right there. There we go. Awesome. Alright, so let's put his weapon in his hand next. If you go either in his left or right hand, I'm going to put it in his left hand. There we go. That's pretty awesome. Little Halo Mega Block figure. Oh! <laughs> oh, that's awesome. He has some articulation on him too. So he has some waist articulation right there. His head moves side to side and up and down. There we go. Arm movement and he has elbow articulation, I believe. Yeah, some elbow articulation. Seems he has a little bit there. And in the wrist, I think. I'm not sure. Yeah, he does right there. Pretty awesome. And his knees bend, and his legs move. So that's pretty awesome. And I, I actually like this Mega Block figure. I never actually buy Mega Blocks, but um, you know, if I get them with something, I'm not going to complain about it. <laughs> so all right, so let's look at the bottom of his feet. I'm guessing he sits right on top of this uh, Mega Block piece right here. I'm not sure if I'm doing this right. Or let's see here. There we go. There we go. Awesome. And now you can display them like this, or however you like, in different poses. Pretty cool. I like it. I like it a lot. Alright, next up we have a magic bag. Well, not really. It's just a little red bag. It says, oh, Assassin's Creed Unity? What? An Assassin's Creed item? Oh, well, let's check this out. Uh, uh, what? Li what Liberty El, El Gal? Oh man, I cannot. Wait a minute. What does that say? I'm assuming that says uh, Liberate El El Galate Unity. Huh. Assassin's Creed Unity. Please excuse my poor grammar. I'm I'm not sure what. I, I, I know that probably stands for Liberty, but I can't make out what that means or what that says. Um, so Assassin's Creed Unity... Uh, wow, this thing... It's legit. Here, I'll tap it on the, my uh, counter right here. Yeah, it's a legit like metal coin or something from Assassin's Creed Unity. That is pretty awesome. Wow, I don't have the game yet. Um, eventually, I will come around to buying it, but I've just been um, focusing on buying other stuff for now. So, oh, that was pretty cool. Assassin's Creed Unity uh, coin. Awesome. All right, so next up, we have this uh, card here. It says, which side are you? Are you a pirate or a ninja? So let's look on the back and pirate versus ninjas. And you guys can read all of that if you want to. And okay, it's describing the shirt that I got. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay, so I was right before. It was a pirate and a ninja combined together in a cool shirt design, which I really like a lot. All right, so let's set this off to the side somewhere and uh, see what else I got here. I got uh, something with a code on it. Huh. Lichdom Battle 
it what battle mage okay and what is this 50 percent off which dumb battle mage hmm first person caster that gives you mage oh well, for steam okay well guys um i don't have a steam account and i doubt my crappy laptop could play games on it so i'm going to give you guys this code for lich dumb okay here it is there's the code it's for 50 percent off uh lich dumb battle mage on steam all right enjoy it all right so let's see what else i got um Full game download. Whoa. $20 value for Super Street Fighter 4 Arcade Edition. Ah, I already got this for the PS3. See? Already have it for PS3. So, uh, guess what, you guys? You want this? You can have it. And there's the code. And put that on Steam, and you can download the full version of Super Street Fighter for arcade edition all right all right so you guys can enjoy that as well and whoa is there another code here what digital comic loot issue number one issue number what 24 of Mega Man I actually might want this <laughs> uh, oh wait Sonic the Hedgehog crossover issue really ooh okay yeah. Wait, is this free? Uh, maybe, maybe not. I'll have to check it out. Ah, yeah, I actually want that, so I'm actually keeping that digital scanner code thingy. Alright, so you guys got two codes. One for Super Street Fighter 4 Arcade Edition, and the other one for Lichdom Battle Mage. So, enjoy! Oh, I actually like this month's Loot Crate magazine. It says Battle... It has an arcade... Uh, cabinet on there on the front cover now usually the front and back page uh, matches up and whoa what's all this I'm seeing some weird cutout shapes I'm pretty sure that's something inside so all right let's take a look at what's inside uh -huh. some of the staff members I'm assuming hey wait a minute is that oh no okay I thought that was someone else uh, Assassin's Creed we sat down with the creators of Assassin's Creed Ubisoft huh so I'm guessing they interview some of the developers. All right, next up, more of the interview for Assassin's Creed Unity. And what is this thing? Oh wow, they came out with a new Funko Pop of Groot. Uh, that's pretty cool. Halo Battles Evolved. Hmm. All right, so I'm guessing they interviewed some of the developers from Halo as well, and that's the November's uh, Mega Crate that you could win. You'd get a Wii U system with Super Smash Bros. Uh, Nintendo 3DS XL, and uh, some Mebos, Pop Wired Fight Pad, okay. Afterglow headset, and F-Series chair, which is pretty cool. Man, I wish I would have won this month's uh, Mega Crate. That would have been pretty awesome to get a Wii U. I just recently bought a 2DS with uh, Pokemon Omega Ruby. So, okay, here's now showing all the stuff that you get in this month's Loot Crate. Pirate vs. Ninja shirt. Yep, pretty awesome. I like it. And what was this? Assassin's Creed for Unity... Wait, Assassin's Creed 4? Unity coin with Velvet Pouch? Hmm... Am I reading that correctly? Assassin's Creed 4? I thought Assassin's Creed 4 is uh, Black Flag, not Unity. Uh, let me look at my video game collection real quick. Uh, yeah, it is uh, Black Flag. I'm looking at over over at my uh, collection over there. So, so uh, it must be a misprint typo or something. I don't know. Maybe it goes along with Assassin's Creed 4. I don't know. Huh interesting all right so yeah i got the mega man mini helmet which is pretty cool i love mega man and uh halo drop ship minifigures 
which you can get, okay, you get the uh, gold guy or the blue guy. And I got the gold guy right there. Or, uh, this is not exactly gold. This is more of a, uh, not sure what color this is. I don't know. I want to say, like, copper or something. But I'm just calling it gold for the heck of it. <laughs> Alright, so that's pretty awesome. Yeah, the Street Fighter headband. <laughs> uh, you guys might be seeing that when I decide to uh, do some more skits in my videos. Um, oh, okay, so those are what those uh, cutout shapes were. For Mega Man and Ryu. Okay, that's pretty cool. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm putting two and two together here. So I'm guessing you cut these out and set them up in this display box, which is uh, pretty awesome. So yeah, so what you do is just pop out those figures and take the tabs and just tab them in this uh, loot crate box. So that's why I had that message on the front saying this box was designed differently from the other loot crate boxes, which is pretty cool. So you can have Mega Man and uh, Ryu fighting in a uh, an alleyway. <laughs> yeah, some more stuff. You get to untab there and put the uh, cutouts in. Light, up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, BA start. Robot repair. Pretty cool. All right, so this month's loot crate, um, not bad. I actually like a few of the stuff that I actually got. Uh, I love the shirt. The shirt is awesome. Ninja versus pirates, or pirate versus ninjas, however you want to say that. So definitely putting that in my closet with the rest of my shirts that I own. Um, headband, good for cosplaying, or if you just want to have fun with. <laughs> this Assassin's Creed Unity ring, um, a ring, not ring, coin. It's a coin, people. Ah. Screwing up, man. I'm tired, man. I got home from work this morning. I got very little sleep. You know how it is when you work a lot and you just screw up in your videos all the time. I do it all the time. Hey, I'm not perfect. <laughs> all right, so I actually like that coin. It's pretty awesome. Uh, this mini Halo figure from Mega Blocks, which is pretty cool because I am a collector of figures and I like to either display stuff around my room or I like to keep figures inside the box. So. This will definitely be going up on display somewhere in my room. Or I'll just keep it inside the Loot Crate box for now. This Mega Man helmet replica, which is pretty cool. I got the red one. It's pretty nice. And once again, I want to put this on one of my action figures, but I don't have any action figures of, uh, <laughs> of a decent size to put that helmet on. Um, this month's Loot Crate pin, which I actually like a lot. It looks pretty awesome. Um, of course, this containment thing, I'm not sure what this is. I'm pretty sure you Halo fans out there know what this is. This is what the uh, figure comes in. So I'll set that aside next to the figure. Uh, yeah, this is the box that the helmet came in. Um, this month's magazine, which comes with some cutouts right there in the back. Or pop-outs. And you could display them inside the Loot Crate box itself. And I actually liked this month's Loot Crate um, magazine with the arcade there. The arcade machine. It says Battle. Pretty awesome. Alright, so... Uh, oh yeah. And these codes, which, once again, I'll show these on camera. And you can input this, uh, both of these on Steam if, if you guys want to. Alright. Um, that's pretty awesome. Yeah, anytime, anytime I usually get codes from Loot Crate, I mostly give them away to you guys, so pretty much expect a code every month. <laughs> um, or almost every month. I know they don't always do code giveaways, but sometimes they do. And this uh, card here describing the shirt or the mythology between pirates versus ninjas. Alright. And of course, yeah, the instruction manual that came with the figure. Yeah, so if you guys know which character is that, let me know in the comments below, because I don't really play much Halo, so the only character I'm familiar with is the main character himself, Master Chief. <laughs> um, what else? Did something else came in this month's Loot Crate? Uh, no, that's about it. Alright, so anyways, yeah, that's all the stuff in 
November's Loot Crate for the, uh, this year, 2014. Once again, this month's theme is Battle. Um, once again, thank you all for watching. And I can't wait uh, for next month's Loot Crate, which I'm assuming is going to be pretty awesome, hopefully. <laughs> Alright, so uh, next video I plan on uploading is my Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle toy haul video, because I usually do those um, every few months because they come out with new figures that I love collecting, and I usually keep them inside the box, people. Yes, I know. That's why I do Ninja Turtle haul videos and not unboxing review videos for those. Um, also, a Black Friday haul video. I will be doing an unboxing for Kingdom Hearts 2.5 Remix for PS3. And, uh, yeah, just, you know, making time for these videos while I have my day off from work. And I'm going to enjoy my day off from work because starting, I think, mm, next week, yeah, not this week, but next week after Thanksgiving, I'm going to be working six days a week. So I'm going to be super busy, <laughs> but I will still try to find time to keep uploading these videos because eh, it's a hobby that I do enjoy. So, you know, I'm always going to be making videos. <laughs> All right. So um, I'll see you guys in the next video. And thank you for watching. Later.